ABC's Rachel Cars is live in Burlington with the latest on what is quite the investigation. A lot of twists and turns going on here, Rachel. Yeah, Steph, that's right. This all started on Saturday morning when a neighbor reported hearing fighting. But when police arrived, the couple told them that Justin Stone had just slipped in the shower. And that was just the beginning. Just before 3 Saturday morning, a 911 caller told Vermont State Police his friend who lived at 51 Woodland Drive had been shot. A little later, another man called 911 saying he had been kidnapped and stabbed. Dispatch tracked the call to Notch Road in Lincoln. Just before 3.30, officials found Cody Toledo on the side of the road. Toledo was taken to UVM Medical Center to be treated for injuries. Police also went back to the apartment on Woodland Drive. Court paperwork shows the apartment was rented to Justin Stone and Corinne Laraway. Police found a blood-soaked doormat and bloodstains leading out of the unit. Once inside, paperwork shows they found heroin baggies, needles, and signs of a struggle. A few hours later, Colchester police arrested Stone and Laraway at the Motel 6, where they found several thousand dollars and a golf ball-sized amount of heroin in their hotel room. Both told investigators in exchange for payment they let a man they called John live in their apartment to distribute heroin. They also admitted to driving John to Notch Road earlier and leaving him there. The duo is being held until their next to court appearance on April 4th. They face up to 20 years in prison and $500,000 in fines. Live in Burlington tonight, Rachel Carr's WPTZ News Channel 5.